now it's time for another round. We're on Jibbed 4, by the way. And a security officer with an afro. Caleb Sheck. Caleb, Caleb Sheck. Hmm. Not very fond of the afro, just because it always looks wrong when you're wearing a hat or a helmet. So you know what? Let's do that. No helmet. I'm gonna go out with a handicap. Uh, wait. So we load up on our usual gear, minus the helmet. Uh, I don't need a headset. Did he already? Yeah, that guy already took the thermals. What is this? I never wanted to be a security officer. Uh, wait, oh, I don't know why I picked up that armor. We might even make it. You mean most of us might make it. Is there an HOS? Probably not. No, Kramer Lexington is our detective. Ooh. Nice. Only two tries this time. So this is the main security area. There's the security equipment, the locker room. It has suits and all the security gear you need. It's a porter brig and the porter brig itself. I don't think I'd ever came with a manual before. At least not any manual I ever read. Let's see. Congratulations, your station has purchased the A97 Porta Brig security device. Using the A97 is simple as beating a criminal to death. <laughs> Simply summon the A97 with the remote, put the criminal inside, lock the door with your ID, and send it back. That's all there is to it. Notice the Porta Brig teleporter system may fail if you are not in an open space. This technology produced under license from Quantum Movement Inc. Limited. Huh. I never read that before, but I kind of already knew that stuff. Another thing that doesn't mention is that when you use the when you summon the Porter Brig with the remote, it will create sparks, which will sometimes blow out a nearby light bulb or light tube. Okay, security cameras, security records. I think there's another security records computer down here. Yeah, right there. There's SecTech vending machine. It's, well, yeah, it's a vending machine. You just don't pay for it. As long as you have a security ID, you can take out as much as you want. Doesn't hurt to have a backup flash. And just one. What? See. Interesting. <laughs> that kind of caught me off guard. How did that? Oh, I see. going in the disposal unit. That's fine. Hmm. So, 
Here's... I don't know what this is, actually. Poor Zerk. Don't get too stressed out, man. What is the point of this? Hmm. It's something that should be common knowledge. If you see those flaps, you can just lie down and then move to get underneath them to get past them. So this is where Beepski stuff is now. Okay. Old beret. Oh, I'm tempted to take that. I don't know how it'd look with the afro though. That's acceptable. It's better than the helmet. No, maybe instead of spending the entire round playing dress up, I'm just gonna actually do my job. Actually, yeah, the beret works with the afro. Now I'm just on my beat, going on patrol. Let's take that E-tank, just in case. There's M old Murray on his tour. Scientist left the emergency shower running. Possibly because they just want people to slip up whenever they enter research. Which really isn't too bad. It's a decent defense. Now here's the med bay, and here's the waiting room. Which is kind of a cool, cool setup. Got the credit transfer device here. So medical, con doc medical doctors can actually charge for their services. If they are so inclined. Not much of a point in it yet, since money doesn't really have much of a use other than using the vending machines. With this, oh yeah, getting the high-powered flashlight, that's actually a decent use for money. Uh, let's see. 5532. And what is this guard buddy doing here? Was he already there? He's not following me, is he? <laughs> um, yeah, let's put that in my backpack for now until I get some decent tools. Warrant issued for Jordan Khan. Oh, I almost didn't notice that because it wasn't over the secure radio. So, apparently our only criminal is Jordan Khan.
stealing what? Stealing the stun baton, maybe? What is still? <laughs> He's probably not going to apologize, but I'll give him a chance if he wants an easy way out. Don't promise anything when this dummy is around. You are too nice. Sorry, janitor, I gave you a chance. You were allowed to apologize. See, that's fair.
he has some points. He has some very good points. If head of commands, or head of the stations are being dicks, or if they're being dumb, or if they're just plain endangering people, then they should really be brought in. And if it turns out they're traitors, then they should be dealt with accordingly, depending on how well they cooperate. But if a head of command is going to be a dick, it's kind of up to the security guard's discretion to arrest them. Usually that's not the way I play. Might not think it's the correct way to play, but as far as I'm concerned, there is no correct way to play. The only real rules you have to follow when you're playing is try not to be a dick, and if you happen to be an AI or a robot, then you know you have to follow your laws. And then there's the rules about the sexual creepiness and bigotry and stuff, but that's not really an in-game sort of thing. That's more of just spouting out random nonsense. Changeling down at bridge? What? Oh, I missed that a while ago then. Uh... <laughs> he spat it spat acid at me. No, it's probably too late now. Um, ooh, this... This looks like a bad situation. Listen, I want the hat. Is he dead now? Uh, we just disappeared. No, he's over there. He's dead. Oh, wait. This is the this is the hallway that goes down to disposals, isn't it? Vultures are already stealing the det detective stuff. I managed to secure the thermals, though. The changeling, I think. A what? Okay. Hmm. That's not cool. I know that the head of personnel took his 
ID, but I just figured that he put it back into his backpack. What's going on here? It's in his bag. Okay, that's what I thought. from 5 to 60. <laughs> mm. Still not quite totally sure what I think about Dr. Sweat Locum. Whether or not he's actually a victim here, or just being a nuisance. Most likely a little of both. That's how it tends to happen. Somebody gets annoyed with security for some reason, or with a head of personnel, for example and they do something that's not really a crime, but kind of annoying. Mildly griefy, maybe. And then it just escalates from there. It, they just go back and forth and make each other matter and matter. It might not, they might not actually be upset, but it still escalates. They have to one-up each other. Which is not really a good thing. What is Lee doing there? Is he just waiting around for attention or what? The name's Forrest. Forrest Gump. <laughs> no. Derek Love is in space without a suit. He's a roboticist. For all I know, he could have broken into chem lab. That's kind of the thing. Because changelings can survive in space, but so can chemists if they have the right combination of chemicals. So, it's entirely possible that Derek Love is not a changeling. But when you catch them flying around in space, and they're a changeling, they usually let you know. Reggie. to deliver a crate of beer. Might as well. <laughs> 
Thanks. If it's security, I can help you. <laughs> Alrighty then. Kind of get the feeling he just wanted to deliver a crate of beer to whoever. Who's this joker? Richard Mc McIntosh? Macintosh? Hmm. Okay, here he's changed the name. I refuse. It is my right to refuse unnecessary needles. probably get some needles or a needle in the beaker riot and the chap hmm writ in the chaplain I'm really hoping she means somewhere near the chapel. Not in here. Oh, shoot. AI is being useless. Never mind AI? What? Oh, the ones at Medbay? I don't know what that's about. Pritchard took my laser taser. Okay. Wait, do we have a syringe and beaker in security? We might. <laughs> I don't really want to go in here. Come on, head of personnel. Why is it so difficult to click on this? Cyborg's getting in the way. Hmm. It's 
taking our toolbox now too. I didn't really come to security to deal with him. Okay, so there is a syringe. There isn't any beaker. I don't have any other sort of container. But any sort of container would do. I could buy like a drink container and use that. It would be nice if security had an alternate exit of some sort. I guess this is really the only alternate exit. Nah, I should have closed that. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, so I got that syringe. I have one pair of handcuffs I don't really need. Is there a welding tool in here? Because I could use that. No, there is not. There is a crowbar, though. I'll take that. That's the sort of tool you never know when it could come in handy. Or maybe rather, you really wish you took one when you got a chance. When you do need it. Uh, I'm not really familiar with where all the vending machines are. Probably already passed by a bunch. I think there's some up north here. No. Arcade, a snack machine. I'm looking for a drink machine. you sweat locum. He's just causing more trouble now, isn't he? Uh, all I really want is either a lighter or a welding tool. Doesn't... Doesn't look like we have either of those here. Oh wait. Let's make a welding tool. That'll work. Yeah. Oh 
Okay, so... Can I put that in my box? Yeah, I can. What else can fit in my box? Not really much else. Alright, well, I'm fine for now. Okay, Khan gets five minutes for assault. I guess it must have been serious or something. Okay. I never did get a container. Let's see if this wine bottle is empty. I can use that as a container. Yes, it is empty. Okay, good. Oh shoot, this is full. Uh, don't really need an emergency soon. Emergency suits. I mean, they're handy. Sometimes. But you really don't want to have to depend on them. They're more of a situational thing, more than anything. Don't know why I'm still on harm at ten. Prisoners should be put in the brick cell. My oh there. suddenly completely healthy. I have no right over. Okay. That's a confirmed then? So Pritchard has been confirmed then. I am lagging like a mofo. Oh, what kind of cake is that? A lot of purple goop cake cake. <laughs> okay, time to get up Pritchard. Get my head back in the game. Temujin and Pritchard? Uh, hmm.
find the person who claimed he was stone. Hmm. Wonder what that was. We follow leads. Good call. Khan was chur buckled in the brig, and I wanted to kick his ass. Serious leg now. Just heard a little explosion a little while ago, so maybe that's related. Oh. Jenny saw that. Oh, what? Probably talking about someone else. Khan? Khan's still in custody? If you see him, arrest him. If he's in custody, then he's already been arrested, so I'm not sure if he's still talking about Khan. One thing about security communication is pretty important, but security often sucks at communication. That is Derek Love spraying fire extinguisher all over the place. That is... who? Was that... it might have been. And I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> do you, I mean, do you think it's better to just not test you? in case we inconvenience the mighty Dr. Pritchard. Aiden Reed, okay. spike right there.
What is going on in there? What are you doing? <laughs> Monkey walks right out. Oh, whatever. I guess I should have expected that. Hmm. Zerk didn't stay down very hard, or very long. Oh, he just pushed him down. I thought he got stunned. Wow, did you all hear that? I didn't. Uprise. Uh, he probably didn't grab that geneticist's ID, did he? Uh, is this guy okay? You hear a voice in your head. Good news, CENTCOM has authorized the death sentence for horrible jerks. I was gonna say. Yep, I got a license to kill. <laughs> oh. Not sure how I feel about that, but if the admins are approving it, then it must be happening way more often than it's supposed to. Someone left Hulk out? Ah. Shoot. This is med lab, so it could be almost anywhere. How does what guy? Uh, 
<laughs> Pick up one crowbar, drop it, take out another. Hulks are going crazy. Derek Love in the bridge. Why were either of them in the bridge? This is all going to hell. And of course, I slipped on the floor that I managed to avoid before. Uh, is he a Hulk or is he a lizard man? No, he's a Hulk. Where's Aiden? I don't even recognize him. Is he cloaked? Or was I just really not paying attention? We need this stuff in the armor. That's kind of the thing about the armory. It's kind of a th there's a lot of things about security. Um, if you open up the armory and arm all of the security officers with lasers, deadly lasers. Those security officers will eventually get killed, and their lasers will be taken and used by either by actual traitors or by people just wanting to cause trouble. Uh, yeah, dude. That's not really cool. Probably isn't really necessary to build this wall back up. This isn't really the most in like secure area anyway. But somebody will find a way to mess things up. Reinforced. Uh. And taser shots being fired. I don't think I can actually get out of here either. I might be stuck. There's no... yeah, there's no button in here to press. How did you get in here? What are you guys even doing in here? be a shrub for the rest of the game. I don't know why Reggie is so intent on standing around the entrance of security. Uh. Zerk Gibson is almost dead. Uh. He has a stupid expression on his face. Yeah. 
Temujin Khan. Sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to push you out of the way. Okay. Setting these two jokers to arrest. records. I'm assuming they're recent arrivals. Lance Egg. You are set to arrest. Or no, you are now at least. Probably isn't really necessary to enter the details, but Temujin Khan is in the brig now. What else am I looking for? Lance Egg Dima Rusikov. Okay, so Dima Rusikov, where are you? There, right near the bottom. Now the shuttle has been called. accidentally punching myself. Oh, and I killed Dr. Pritchard. <laughs> Again with stun gloves. Hmm. What the hell is a Voltron? <laughs> Grey shirts, come join me in the bar. You shall get a weapon of incapacitation for stealing of shoes. Huh? Hmm, I don't like the sound of that. Prepare for 
to Mujin Khan. I was being arrested. Well, come to the barn. Arrivals. We will stun them and steal their shoes. <laughs> That might be taking it a little too far. Aiden Reed punches... Wait, wait. Where did Aiden Reed come from? Oh, he's right there. No, that's... Yeah, that's Aiden Reed. Okay. pretty handy to put harm intent on when you're using a taser because then you can do point blank shots if you're on help intent you won't do point blank shots yeah why did you just punch me he's like surrounded by a ton of other people but he didn't punch them uh, where did he go why am I having so much trouble finding him did he go down here or did he go towards security I wouldn't be surprised if it was towards security. Fall back. I have a feeling I'm going to need to use this. Flashbang. is going down. <laughs> I can't use the flashbang now, unless I want to stun myself as well. Uh, who hit me? Aiden Reed tries to... I don't know who hit me. Oh, he got me. Oh, yeah, that's about all you can do. <laughs> I'm deaf, by the way, so whatever I type in or whatever anyone else types in, I won't be able to hear. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, come on. Lance Egg has me. Bang will help against him. Fuck. Got me. Did 
I just drop this flashbang? I guess I must have. And I switch now to help intent so I don't actually stun myself. Okay. I accidentally hate or hit Jacob there. Hey. Well, <laughs> my mistake. <laughs> my mistake for apologizing. so quickly. still don't have my shoes. Someone must have taken them in the madness. Hopefully stepping on cigarette butts doesn't hurt. Uh, I should probably close that. Ah. Uh. Is he even awake? Okay. Zerk prop part of the problem. Oh, well. I think I don't know. Security team wasn't like we weren't the best secure team ever, but I think we did pretty good considering the circumstances. 
I think everyone on the security team did well, including the head of personnel, which I didn't think much of in the beginning. Oh, can we make it? I'm not sure if we can. I'm a little bit injured, so maybe that's slowing me down. What I would like to know is why the fuck you beat me with a stun baton. You did kind of just, you know, stand on top of the person that I was trying to beat. I had already passed him. Technically, crew rebellions are bannable. I did learn that beating up a Hulk actually takes away his powers, so that's kind of nice. nice to know. And that's how you play security. Uh.